Liam, uh, sum up how you're feeling after that great win for Tipperary. Just proud, uh, really proud. You know, our character was tested. You know, we went a man down, we went five points down. You know, we were, we probably had some tight decisions that could have went our way, and oh, that's that's a difficult job that Sean has to do as well. You know, but overall, I thought, you know, we just dug it out. We we, we showed great character. We we really saw the distance. You know, I suppose people would have questioned our pace, questioned our resolve, questioned our work. And today, I think they, they answered some of those questions. Look, it is it is only a semi final, but for us, it's a really really pleasing day out and a really really good workman like performance under difficult circumstances. This when you're a man down. The incredible character shown by the players down down a man down with five points in the second half and they just kept digging. They kept digging and they kept digging and that's what probably makes me most proud this evening. You know, the work they've done, John, for the last seven months has just been heroic and you know I suppose some days you get the rewards and some days you don't and as I said it's been a difficult month for us, you know, losing the Munster final and probably took a lot of flack over the way we played in the quarter final but it didn't it didn't impact on our belief and I suppose our structure and what we could bring to the pitch today and as I said thankfully when the questions were asked we we had the answers. Only barely but we had the answers. But a couple of disallowed goals and you know a man down, it would have been easy to feel like it wasn't your day, but the players obviously never doubted themselves. No, no, they're a great bunch. They're a great bunch. They've built a really good camaraderie about themselves over the last number of, of uh, months and you know it's great to see that coming to the fore today and on what is one of the biggest days of all, you know, in our Ireland semi final, you know, it's it's a it's a tough place to come and win. But I suppose we had the experience of being here before and you know we, we have real character in our group and a good mix of youth and experience and uh, thankfully we needed every bit of that over the course of the 80 minutes. And a big impact from the bench? Yeah, huge impact from the bench, you know, and I think, you know, I'd have huge credit for them, you know, I suppose when you don't get to start, you you can let that maybe that be, be a shade of disappointment, disappointed what we spoke about, you know, thought Jake Morris's catching point there and the finish summed it up, you know, Willie Connors, Mark Hill, all the guys that came in, they just went about their business in a hugely professional manager manner and I suppose I'm really, I'm really proud, I, I can have the job of trying to give these boys their platform and my God, when they got their platform today, they played. Ten years on from 2009, it's Kenny again in all Ireland final. Yeah, not even going there, as I said, I've just, I've just been through a roller coaster of emotion, we're just delighted to be back in all Ireland final and I will enjoy tonight. But that must be brilliant for the group, a win like that. Yeah, it's huge, it's huge, you know, I mean, I suppose over the course of the, the all Ireland finals, all Ireland semi finals, you know, you see what the, the all Ireland semi finals gave us last year, uh, you see what the all Ireland finals have given us uh, this year, so we certainly remain to have the jewel in the crown in the game of hurling and I'm just thrilled to be uh, to, to have got over the line and find ourselves in the Ireland final again in three weeks' time. Thanks, John.